everybody, this is Sarah Neck reporting for Squim High School GNN. I'm here to show you guys just a little bit about glass fusing. Miss Hall, tell us a little bit about glass fusing. Okay, glass fusing is an awesome kind of a project to work with because people don't usually work with glass. Uh, colored glass is usually used for things like stained glass, but in this case you get to melt it in a kiln and turn it into different useful products. Um, you can wear it, you can use it, you can see it, look at it up on a wall, anything. It's just beautiful medium to work with. Okay, some of the projects that we work on in the glass fusing class, we start out with making small pendants that people can wear. Um, using things like di dichroic glass, which is beautiful, beautiful, shiny, shimmery glass that changes color when you look at it, when, you, when it changes direction. Uh, we m use kiln paper between pieces of glass to make designs. We use something called glass line that you can etch into and make designs and then also put it between pieces of glass so you can make a pendant out of it. Um, then we moved on to two different kinds of wind chimes. One set makes one certain kind of a noise, another set has a different kind of a jangly noise. They're both very beautiful, melodious tones. Uh, the next thing we work on are sun catchers that you can put up in the window. And we also work on making candle holders or something that will hold keys. We, we slump little squares of glass into sort of a cup shape that has corners on it. And we also make larger pieces that can be fired one time and then they're fired a second time and slumped into bowls and plates. So there's decorative uses for the glass like pendants and earrings and there's also utilitarian things like bowls and plates that you can use in the house all the time. But a lot of times it's just really nice to be able to just put them up on a wall and be able to look at your work because they're just beautiful. Alright, well that's all I have for you guys today. Signing out, Sarah Neko.